this is the first time I've ever seen one of these spiders in my garden, although I understand they're not that rare, they're quite common, but very difficult to spot even though they're white. This is a, a white crab spider, some people call it a white death crab spider, not sure why. Um, it's Amina vatia. Um, but it's absolutely gorgeous and I noticed it because it was making signals with its arms. I don't know um, if it was perhaps looking for a mate or communicating with another spider but it was uh, it was making sort of the semaphore signals almost and I'll try and uh, I'll try and pick it up so that you can see it's not huge but it's uh, you can tell it's a crab spider straight away let's just get it moving a bit let's see if I can delicately get it on my hand there we go. So now you kind of get an idea of the size. It's got massive uh, abdomen and markings on the back. It's quite it, obviously quite easy to uh, where am I? Quite easy to recognise if you have any. There he is down there. I'm gonna let him go now. But uh, I just thought I'd share it with you because he's a beautiful little arachnid. See if you can spot them. I, I found it on an oxide daisy originally, or near an oxide daisy. I don't know if they, they sit on the heads and wait to predate uh, pollinators, possibly. But uh, he's gorgeous. Let me get it closer. And then we'll let him go. Let me know if you've got any or seen these. I'm in the UK, obviously. But uh, let me know if you've got anything similar where you are. Leave any comments below. Thanks for watching.